tigers and titans? I might try it. Like, it doesn't work. Really Late? After a week in which the Tigers former playmaker Benjamin Marshall grabbed all the headlines, it was the visiting halfback grabbing the limelight at the like half over. Billy, Billy, Worthy, Bobby, Jackie, and still going, really. And pirouetting, if you like. There's another adjective. What a run. He's the ball eight metres out. Balloon, double pump. He's got away from Caesar. Caesar's over the line. Puts the ball down. He'll score a try. And he points to the spot. Referee the home side had numbers on the left, but the wily Albert Kelly was one step ahead of his opposite number. Come up with Kelly. So here's Kelly again down the ground of Brooks and Scotty. But Kelly frees himself, then he beats another one. Luke Brooks was proving a handful, though. Now on his inside, Brooks has gone through his passes to the power. Now they need a quick play the ball. And Nate Miles was given a 10 minute rest for a professional foul on Marcus Cow. Down to 12 men, the Titans line was breached. And the way to the Hampton has gone out. Video referee upheld the on-field decision, ruling an obstruction by the block runner Bodine Thompson. Aiden Caesar had scored all of the visitors' points, so this was a worrying sight. The pivot stayed on the field but handed kicking duties to Greg Bird, who added the Gold Coast second penalty goal of the afternoon. The Titans made their own luck. Frank and Astor's kick eagerly snaffled up by Paul Carter. Carter takes it down the ground, gave it to Don, and Don sprints away. The usual like hard charm wasn't working its magic for the Tigers, scoreless and trailing by 16 at the halfway mark. The Gold Coast returned to the field without an injured Kelly, and there was another blow to come. Off to get the kick in as a ricochet, and then he puts it on the boot again. He leads the race, the weight of the ball is scored. No, it's not, it still might be a chance. It still might be a chance here for Simona. Another look confirmed Blake Austin didn't knock on and the Tigers were back in the hunt. After etching his name on the score sheet, Tim Simona put a black mark next to it on the report for lifting Caesar. And that's the dangerous throw that we want out of the game. The 5'8 wasn't hurt and had his revenge soon after. Oh. The King has a grab of time! And it's a try for the 11th Greg Bird! Yep, Abby. Now it's Larry. Good boy, Abby. They just point to the spot. The Titans turned a messy play the ball into a tidy shift right. And he's gone from the balloon and gone on to Miles. Miles got it away, Caesar got it on, catch and pass Nielsen, and they're heading to the corner. But despite his aerial acrobatics, Anthony Dom was denied the four points. It was a busy afternoon for the men upstairs. Next, called on to check on Liam Fulton's grounding of a Brooks grubber. He's come back with his head down like a beaten face. Carter chimed in with defence that was at one moment sublime. Chris James put the snap kick in off. That's oh. a brilliant, brilliant take by Carter. And at the next, not so much, on report for a high shot on David North Baluma. But there was little that could dampen the Titans' spirits. A convincing 16-point victory giving them the rare treat of leaving Leichhardt with two competition points. Mm -hmm.